Hello there and welcome back to another episode in Atrio. So in the previous one, we've actually started uh, sending some uh, corrosive battles already down and uh, our next mission really is to find the deer station sub uh, supply pod and beat all the levels which we have done as well i think it was somewhere down here we have disconnected the um, power already from there but yeah all that was completed so what we have to do now is bring a deer replacement to the station one so let's have a look at what sort of conversation or dialogue we're gonna have here now okay greetings little droid hello I see you're still alive. That's the burden of my mortal coil. Okay, we'll keep an eye. We'll keep our eyes open uh, for any coils. But first, I need to do battle at the supply port. Okay, I think they don't know we've already done it. It seems so. No, it's uh, never mind. You'll find the supply port just south of my station. Now go. Um. All right. So I guess we weren't supposed to complete it earlier. Let's have a look. Did we get anything special from there? But we don't have any... Yeah, we went from this way, didn't we? I mean, we can die here. It's fine. We've got nothing on us right now. And yeah, I'm pretty sure it was... Like, here. Wasn't it? Yeah, we've done them all. Okay. So, why don't we jump back real quick. Go to our base and... Um, <laughs> bring a deer replacement to station one. So maybe it's the mechanical deer. So we need the hardship, heart valve, and the heart cell. So I guess we'll teleport back. Where's the teleportation device again? Um, <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna have a look around, see if I can find it. Never mind, it seems I was quite blind, so here we go. We teleport from there. We'll head to station 2, pick up our stuff. I'm pretty sure we had half the ingredients already, but let's... um. Take a quick look. Okay. That's already pretty full there as well. Right. So here we go. Hopefully our bag is still here. Yes, it is. We have the heart cell, heart valve, and what are we missing? Oh, we are missing heart chip. Okay. Fine. How do we make one? Heart chip. Here it is. Okay. So we need the blood cube, computer chip, and corrosive paste. Hmm, okay, let me guess. Corrosive paste can be most likely made with the deer as well. And since everything is sort of a bit of a backlog over here, why don't we remove a few of you guys? Oh, that's probably gonna be a problematic and clog up some of our uh, lines as well. So, oh dear, okay. Are we gonna be able to pick you up? Yes, we are. Okay, lovely. Here we go. I think we can take all of them because... We're gonna have to produce quite a bit of quite a bit of that new paste. Okay, a bit more space now. We can take these eggs as well. And drop them. Where do you guys need to go? Going all the way there around. Oh yeah, the batteries. Okay, here we go. Drop them in here. And we should be good now. Right, so next task. To make that paste, I guess we could make one manually. Oh. Maybe we cannot. So if we place you on the second one, got a bit of space over here. Okay. Change it over and corrosive paste. Lovely. Now we need the blood cube. That should be pretty good as well. Oh, actually, never mind. Let's um just make a few more around this area, and we probably do wanna let's send them this way for now. Oh, wait a second. Well, that's uh, not ideal, but that's okay. Oh, it's the harvest rock is in the way. Gotcha. Right, blood cubes. Here we go. And the next thing we need... Oh, the last thing. Computer chip with wires. That should be here as well. Off you go. And now if we can get one of those green eggs, that would be... That's it then, isn't it? Okay. Right, make one of those. Now we're a bit full, aren't we? Okay, drop that one. Make this one. Lovely. Hard chip. And I think we have everything now. Okay. Bring a deer replacement to station one. So why don't we do that? I guess we are going to have to run all the way back there again. All right. There we go. Let's see what news they bring us now. Requesting station one chip for employee. Okay. So we're going to get the chip, hopefully. Okay. No need. Let's set you free. Farewell, little droid. Farewell, my friend. Oh, wow. 
Okay. Ah, oh, he's free now. Aww. Oh, that's really adorable. What happens to Station 5 now? And off he goes. Does that mean all the deer that are in the nature are... Like, humans? Wow. Okay, the music's changed up quite a bit as well, and... Uh, we've unlocked an achievement, Fawn Friends. Right. Can we open? We've done all this, and we messed something up because we... Oh, that must be him. Or maybe it's this one. I don't know. That's really happy and sad at the same time because I don't know if we've messed it up. All levels completed. Well, there you go. What do we do now? Did we really mess, mess up our save game because we started this before the mission asked us to do it? Well, I guess the only way to find out is let's bring the chip to station 2. So here we go. We're back. We've got the chip now. Let's see what happens. Upgrade. Hmm. Upgrade 0 out of 5. Very interesting. Oh wow, that's a... Uh... Wait, we have this already. Graphite? Ooh, wow. That's a lot of new stuff. Oh, the cabbage and soybean as well. Okay. Well, that's gonna be interesting now. Station 1 online. Uh, technically, I think we unplugged... I think it was Station 4. All stations are now online starting... Project Human Final Phase. Emergency food supplies. Alright, let's skip all this. And right, there we go. Unplug. Lovely. Vegetable pack. Oh, we're gonna have to be running back and forth all the time now. <laughs> well, the missions now, they don't show anything here, which is interesting. Smelter. Metal can, graphite. I have a feeling we actually can set up maybe that farm station somewhere here. Well, let's have a look. Electronics, dehyde, preserve food. Oh, interesting. We need a couple of computer chips. How do we make wires again? Oh yeah, we do have... Wait a second. Wires we cannot make, can we? No. That's something we find in the nature. Right, right, right. So wires should be here. 71. That's quite a, quite a few. I do want to lighten... Our backpack a little bit as well. Can we store anything? No, not really. All of you guys can go. Don't think we need this stuff right now. Sort it as well. Maybe even these ones. I think with the rest, let's just hold them for the time being. I think we'll be fine. Now to make wires, we just need a few of those white flowers. Oh yeah, we got plenty over here. Let's just grab a couple. There we go. A couple of wires. Oh... Cabbage, seed, potato seed, soybean. Right. So it need, we need to have the dehydrator chip, metal can, and the cabbage itself. So that's quite a... Quite advanced things over here. Okay. So how do we make all this? Is it from one of those factories? I'm sure we can do it. Let's try the electronics one. We, we do have you with us right now. Okay. What recipes? Oh, you can make the chips only. Oh, and the blood cubes as well. <sighs> that means we still have to connect up the, the station. This one here. Power-wise... Actually, can we do more power first? Corrosive fuel. Green mushrooms. Are we growing them? I think we were. Yep, we're doing them here. Nope, right here. And we need the corrosive paste for you as well. Hmm, this is getting quite messy already. So what we could perhaps do is send these mushrooms back over here. And set up like a little factory for this fuel. I know it's not going to be enough space in here. But if we want to make this a little bit better. I guess this whole section here could be sent towards this way in the future because there's lots of space here that we are not really using could help us a little bit but for now yeah i think we just go with what's easy to make a factory we are gonna need some blood ore which i think we did drop off just a second ago number seven there we go let's have a look and oh yeah 
So let's bring the paste over here as well. Mushrooms need to jump over. We have a few of them already. So yeah, what if they just keep going straight ahead? Or if this one's full and you no longer mm, need them, this might be a better solution actually. Yeah, we can jump over from here as well. Oh no, wrong button. I'm so used to having the, uh, the pipes on number two. Probably need some more materials to make a few more pipes. Yep, let's grab you as well. Right, a few queued up. That should be more than enough for our purpose right now. So you can come over here. And it's not going to be pretty. But how shall we... I guess we are going to have to do it in a similar style. Okay, so you go there. You're going to go out from here. Oh no, you're going to have to jump over as well, I think. And uh, now we're going to need a few more of these lovely so everything that has been going in here there's quite a few already now we need to send it over but i think what would make more sense is if we were making it a little bit closer yeah it is getting a bit messy again but we'll jump over from here and then maybe jump over from here again and bring it further there we go now we can Link this up. Another jump over. And I think we have it now. You jump over again. We're gonna go this way. Maybe this way. And how do we feed you in here? I think this is the way we should do it. Can we guide you through here? Yes, we can. But we don't have any more. Do we have any spare ones? It would be nice, actually, if we were producing them automatically. Were we doing them automatically somewhere? Don't really remember. Uh, to make those, you need gravity ore. And I guess if we were to place, let's say, a factory over here with a chest as well, which we don't have, of course. Oh, never mind. We got one of these ones. Bit of an overkill. But... It's fine. Look at that. Okay, here we go. And we could even fill you up with all of them. Lovely. Let's grab a few more. That should be enough for, for us now. Here goes the mushrooms. Lovely. And how long does it take? Five seconds. Okay, so that's not too bad. And now we can connect up the rest as well. One over there. And here comes the first of the fuel. So let's uh, connect up the station as well. I do feel that we are going to have to. How far can you go? This way. And one more to connect them up. Connect them up. Those blood cubes, we are going to have to send them back over here. It is a bit full over here, if I'm completely honest. But that's fine. It's not the... It could be a lot worse, is what I'm trying to say. It could be. I mean... Oh, I guess we are going to have to automate the computer chips now as well. But to make wires, we need the scrap wires. Oh, wait a second. We can make the wires from the sap based. Oh, wow. That looks like a, a lot of automation. Okay, so give me a second to really figure out in which order do we need to do all those things to, to get this vegetable back completed. Okay, so quick... Uh, check in as well we've done a little bit of rearrangement over here so first of all oh wow it is uh, getting a little bit laggy because there's quite a few things in here so yeah we've cleaned up this zone that's all going through there now which is pretty pretty simple to rearrange let me just try and run up here okay maybe there's a bit less of a lag right so let's stop for a second we had to add a couple more of the mini deer up that zone there just have a bit more sap based buff is expiring oh that's fine that's this one here uh yeah because the fertilizer was uh not keeping up with our production we do have another line of mushrooms as well so yeah batteries they are all good yeah bit of a back backlog here as well and then the tricky part was just getting the wires and everything done over here so first of all the um iron ore was starting to run out and we had to go back to station 5 just to reconnect a few things and add a few more harvesters as well but once that was done we were able to start producing metal cans then also the uh, scrap wires 
which were then turned into the normal wires. Right, right, right. So there we go. And then finally, we have the computer chips over here, which currently are running all the way down here across and right over here where they get turned into dehydrator chips. Yeah, that's quite a bit. And then, of course, we brought the um, blood cubes in here as well because I realized we don't re really need to bring them in from station three. It was a simple recipe with the gravity ingots and blood ingots, so yeah, that's where it is. So the next step really is to start producing a wrong button. Here we go. Some cabbage, potatoes and soybean. And for that, I'm thinking it should be fairly straightforward. It just... Oh, okay, we are going to need a few of those. Yeah, I think we just do like a three rows. Okay, quick save. There we go. Grab a few more of you, and <laughs> I do believe we need a few of those eggs as well. Okay, quite a bit actually. How many can we produce now? One, two, three, four, five. I think we need a few more. Yeah, it would be easier if we had those eggs in a box somewhere here, but that's fine. We'll um, get a few of them done. Yeah, the vegetables themselves we can produce somewhere here. Then we need to also bring down all of those cans. We could set up this production over here, actually. Yeah, if all the stuff goes up, back it up over here, and then I'm not really sure where we need to feed it. But the uh, vegetables themselves, I mean, there is a bit of extra space over here, but it is probably going to need some water as well. <laughs> There's no way we can get water over here unless we go all the way down. Let's have a look. Yeah, water should be somewhere here, which is quite far away. We could also try and find some from here. Okay, so why don't we make some water pumps and set up a quick little vegetable farm right underneath there. Yeah, lots more space over here, so that might be more suitable. So yeah. Let's do it over here. We might have to rearrange a few things, but that should be fine. Three rows and uh, we'll be back as soon as it's set up. Okay, so there we go. After spending quite a bit of time to figure out how to do it, um, we, we do have a bit of a design in here and I think, I uh, hope it's going to work. So first of all, this one actually takes three resources as well. So we need the seed, obviously, which the bees are going to help us out with. And we do need water based, not just water, but this one's the base. And then the fertilizer, which we had to drag from uh, half across the map. I think you still still remember remember where it was before. And uh, yeah, so over here as well, I had to capture a few more of those mini deer. And now they just turn water into, into paste. And that one takes 10 seconds. So I actually do worry that having seven of you here is not going to be enough. But I guess we'll, we'll see. I mean, three rows, yeah. I don't think it's going to be enough, but um, we'll, we'll see how it goes. So, since they need two different types of resources at the same time, we have the same dispense chests on both sides. So we alternate between the fertilizer and the water paste. And what happens then, once we harvest those things, we are going to have to send them all the way up to our factory. So over here, we are producing the dehydrator chips over here. And they get sent to all these three factories, which will produce us different types of food so canned soybeans in this one potatoes and cabbage i think we are running out of power so there we go okay and over here we also need the metal cans so yeah that was kind of challenging there wasn't a lot of space here to to work with and um, i think two of them since it makes them every four seconds I think it will be enough, but if not, we can move a few things around as well, and oh well, I think we'll be able to produce at least one vegetable back, so let's see what happens. Okay, there we go. Oh, one more. Lovely, so 10 per minute here as well. Let's leave it for a little bit. Let's do 15. Let's see what happens. Okay, same with you. Nope, there we go. And I think the research was done. I don't quite remember if that was the last one. Or maybe we had a couple more. Alright, here we go. Oh no, okay. So one more left. No, two. Okay. Sorted. Beautiful. Other than that... Hmm. Yeah, everything seems to be going. I have a feeling 
maybe we have to steal like one of those deer from here. I mean, there is a pretty healthy backlog. Right, so it goes this way, it goes around. Uh, where do you jump from here? Oh, you go up there. Okay, I see. And then a couple of these factories over here. So over overall, our battery production seems to be going pretty well. There is no backlog anymore, which is unfortunate, but... Let's see, 228 right now, but we can take up to 343. So that's, I think, more than enough. So maybe we can slow you down a little bit. That's 210 per minute. Okay, we'll see what happens. And, I mean, if we have to, we can probably disconnect, like, this link over here as well. Okay, cool. So, <laughs> let's see our production. Have we produced anything at all? Oh... I know what's wrong. We need to put some seeds in them. Okay, fine. Oh, and hold on a second. We also have one of you. So let's do it this way. You're gonna go... Okay, that's enough. Right, so... Hmm. Sorted. Soybean. Where is the, the food? Okay, potato seed and soybean. Cool. So, how about we put the potatoes over here? Cool. Soybean. Oh, the beans. Oh, yeah. Soybean. There we go. In this one. So, we start growing the seeds at least, and then uh, they can be used in the other sections as well. There we go. Cabbage seeds are now in. Alright, so there we go. We have a few uh, food items already that, that are queued up over here. So, all we need now is to try and bring them in here to connect them with those factories and I think that should be pretty straightforward as well okay so you can't go closer than that uh, that's a little bit in our way so why don't we let's see if we send the cabbage over like so okay hopefully we still have electricity over here yes we do seems to be working now some food coming out as well why is this one not Potatoes, that one. Oh, I see. Okay. Gonna have to send you through as well. Metal cans. Okay. So, got those three items. I guess we could... Yeah, let's just grab one. How many do you need? Okay. So, we got one of them. How many do we need? To progress further, let's have a look. Upgrade. Here's the food. A oh, one out of five. Right, I thought that might be it. Okay, well, let's see what happens. Adding recipes. Meal kit. Start dialogue. Let's have a look at this then as well. Alright, food anal analysis. Contamination is at 0%. Okay, ration is, ration is approved for human consumption. Proceed to next step. Meal kit. Ah, okay. Meal kit and what to be water filter interesting okay well <laughs> i mean we are harvesting some stuff over here but i feel like we could kick them out and let's take a look so if we expand the factory over here i think that's probably the best area although it takes three resources so it might get a little complicated over here yeah i don't really want these guys here anymore i think we have enough of that stuff as well so we don't really have to worry too much okay can we make a few more factories as well don't suppose oh yes we can lovely now let's have a quick check how long does it take vegetables Oh, these ones. And honey. Don't think we can make honey or automate it, but there must be a way. Anyways, let's figure this out. So you think, oh, only four seconds. So we might not need this factory to be too big, but these guys are a little bit annoying. Let's do one over here just for starters. This one goes from here and you can go right up there as well. Send you through and this one. Oh no. Could please move out of the way. Let's, um... Okay. We're full. Right. Store everything. Oh, I see. Vegetable pack. That's the one we want in here. Now store everything. Open this up. Lovely. Okay. That seems to be working. We can connect 
everything up again. Uh, right, right, right. So for the meal pack, we are going to have to get some honey. That takes two seconds, so that's even quicker. Okay, so how about we stick over here for the time being. Meal kit. And now we just need to feed it with honey. So let's grab that. Ah, oh, you're pretty full. You can go. Let's take these ones. Okay, so lots of soybeans over here. Cabbage is a little bit slower, but that's probably due to our production. Okay, so meal kits are coming out now. We do need one of those boxes, so <laughs> let's do that. Alright, lovely. Technically, we don't really need that there, but it just looks a little bit better. Okay, do we need to increase the numbers here as well? I think we do. Yeah, they're not really reaching all the way to the end over there, so... How about 23? Seems like they reach, yeah, the first couple, but once we start getting this backlog over here, then I guess... Yeah, we should be fine. Okay, so how about we grab all of those meals? I don't think we needed too many of them. I believe it was only one. Yep, and we can already progress, so here we go. Upgrade two out of five. Download recipes. And let's see if the next task is going to be a little bit more difficult. Water filter. Okay. Dialogue time, time again. Oh. Food analysis, contamination is still at 0%. Reasons unknown, you're not trying to kill me, are you? Negative. Likelihood has been increased to 99%. Okay, in addition, the consumption of cockroach meat will be less satisfactory if consumed alone. Maybe we can decorate the base. No. <laughs> Would be nice. Oh, okay. Seems like it's developed some sort of feelings now. Right, what happens here? Well, it looks like this is it. I'm on the last can of food. To be fair, I never thought I'd last this long. Sorry to hear it. Are you really going to uplo upload yourself into a cockroach? I mean, why not give it a shot? They live forever. Fair point, not to be too blunt. But if I m ever make it to your bunker, you mo won't mind if I steal all your bunker decorations. Okay, do what you want. Agreed. Ignore that email and proceed with the mission. Which is what? What do we have to do now? Bring one of those water filters. Wait, what does it unlock? Water bottle and water based. Hang on a second. We already have the water based. A little bit confused. Well, let's see. Graphite and transistors. Okay. Oh dear. Does that m mean we are going to have to uh, revisit our super messy area over there? How do we make graphite? I think I saw it. Oh, here it is. Iron ingots. And transistors to make the... Uh, okay, so ingots are over here. But we also needed some transistors, which are actually over there. Are they? No, right over here. It's a little bit slow because we're making the wires and computer chips. Because you're taking the corrosive metals and scrap metal. Actually, that one's pretty slow as well. So yeah, there isn't a lot of space here. And we probably have to switch this around a little bit. I mean, we could add some factories and make some more metal over here. Then steal some of those corrosive metals and create this alternative production over here instead. But uh, I think we're going to try and do it in our next episode. I have a feeling we're not too far from the finish. So, so yeah, only three more levels because that's the two out of five now. So uh, very close to the end, I believe. And uh, let's try and completed in our next episode this one uh, seems to be going pretty nicely now as well so happy days over here but yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed i look forward to seeing you in the next episode